Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my Ipsy bag for the month of November. For those of you guys that don't know, Ipsy is a monthly subscription. It has um, more than anything beauty products, hair care, uh, skin care, nail stuff, makeup, etc, etc. And it is $10 a month and I will put the link down below in case you guys are interested in checking it out. So, uh, let's get started. First and foremost, um, this is the first time that I've gotten such a weird bag. Did anybody else get a bag like this? You know, it's generally that metallic-y, hot pink um, bag that we get in the mail. But this is like a, it's just weird. I don't know. Am I being picky? Eh. Did anybody else get this bag? Let me know. I'm curious because I've never had a bag like this. Um, my friend, well she's like my sister, she also um, got her Ipsy bag, and she, I think the day before I did, and it's the normal bag, I don't know, maybe they run out of bags, whatever, this bag is always such a pain in the butt to open, Ugh. finally, alright, first thing I'm going to do is take out this little card, this month's theme is Girl Meets Glitter, and it says life is short, wear glitter. I'm uh, not about that life, but okay. Okay, so this month's bag looks like this. Soft. It just reminds me of Barbie. And it's, I don't really like it to be honest with you. They've had better bags. So the first thing I see is a Be A Bombshell eye, ma eye Mace. Just kidding. The first thing I see is Be A Bombshell Eye Base. And this is in the shade Submissive. This is actually really pretty. This is just what the packaging looks like. It looks like the um the Maybelline, Maybelline color tattoos and it's just the same little glass packaging. And I actually really really like this shade. If you guys can see it's like a bronzy, like a it's like a bronze shade. It's bronze and then you can see like gold glitter in it and it's actually really pretty. It's not that pigmented it's very creamy it does apply um very creamy but it's definitely a color that you have to build up but i feel like it would be a really pretty um eyeshadow base and this is what the little pan looks like i've gotten be a bombshell products from ipsy before and they're pretty good i like them and i enjoy them the heck is this okay sorry so the next thing that i got is <laughs> the next thing that I got is this highlighter and this is from the brand temp2 and it is in pink pearl and I'm guessing this is just like a highlight for your skin or for your inner corner or whatever it's just like a liquid highlight and I don't really want to it's just not that intense so this is just like a liquid highlight it looks white in the tube but it is very pink I guess it's very iridescent pink and um, I don't know if I, I probably won't wear this on its own. I might wear it and top it off with a powder highlight and let you guys know how it looks. The next thing in this bag is a waterproof liquid eyeliner from Elizabeth Mott. So this is just a waterproof liquid eyeliner. It's called You're So Fine. And I have received Elizabeth Mott products before in my Ipsy bag. And um, I think it's kind of glittery. I can't tell. But when you apply it, it looks like it has silver glitter, but when you apply it, you really can't see a lot of the glitter. Um, it is and seems really, 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 really intense. Like, it's really, really black. And I love eyeliners like that. I'm not sure if it dries down to a matte finish yet. But I'm interested to try it because I do love waterproof liquid eyeliners. And lately, I used to be more of a gel eyeliner girl, but lately I've gotten more into liquid eyeliners. So I am pretty excited to try this. I hope it works the next product in my ipsy bag is a lip tar i think it's this little guy right here and it is i can't really see it it's from jcat i think and it's a wonder lip paint this is in the shade red potion and my friend actually got the i think it's like a hot pink fuchsia one 
and she wanted this one haha <laughs> sucker I got it this is the one I wanted <laughs> and um, I'm not sure what these claim to be like how long wearing they claim to be um, if they want to be comparable to like lip tars or anything the OCC lip tars which I don't own I don't know I'm not sure if it's any good it looks pretty pigmented I'm not sure if you can like pack on the color like if you can layer it without it getting patchy it doesn't swatch that patchy and the color looks pretty um if it really isn't that good as just like a lipstick kind of thing then um i think it'll just be a nice gloss to finish up red lips when you want to get it glossy okay so the last thing in my ipsy bag it's this mark anthony oil of morocco argan oil this is sulfate free it's supposed to give you um volume and shine extra hold it's supposed to be fast drying it has um does it have it's infused with keratin and this is a hairspray I have never tried any of the Mark Anthony products um, I've heard good things but again I've never tried them it doesn't smell bad it smells pretty good and I hope that it gives like hold but it's not like crunchy so this month we got um, two samples and that would be the highlight the liquid highlight and the Mark Anthony hairspray and then the other three products were a full size if I am not mistaken um, this lip paint does look like this this lip paint does seem to be full size and then this be a bombshell eye base I'm pretty sure it's full size and I think this is full size as well the eyeliner either way as per usual I will link down below all the the prices of these products and um, you know so you can see the money's worth of this bag and maybe that can help you decide if you want to get this bag or not in the future if you guys have watched my other ipsy bags you guys know that i've had um kind of i don't want to say hit or miss but i haven't i've been unhappy with my bag then i've been happy with my bag and this month i am probably neutral because it's such an inexpensive subscription service i will probably continue to have it just because you know sometimes you'll get like a bomb product and I don't want to miss out you know besides that the bag is probably the only thing that I'm not happy with I'm just like whatever but then again it's Christmas I might just gift this thing and give a whole bunch of goodies in this little bag and give it to somebody who likes glitter Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Thumbs up this video if you liked your Ipsy bag. And if you didn't, leave me a comment down below as to why you didn't like it. And yeah, I hope you guys have a good day. And I will see you guys really soon. Bye.